Supporting young people to manage goals is a key part of positive youth development, and we know that it is critical for promoting social and emotional learning. Listen to how St. Ignatius School helps young people manage goals. Um, I work in a middle school and some of the ways I help our students work towards achieving their goals are both in the classroom setting and on a one-on-one basis. I'm lucky enough to be in the classrooms once a week with all of our students. Um, And I work with sixth, seventh and eighth graders. With the sixth graders, we really focus in on the short-term goals and we look at them as short-term meaning, what do they want to accomplish by the time they graduate? in eighth grade. Um, And so by looking at those goals, we break them down into achievable chunks and we do that with lots of activities. So one thing I'm doing with my students right now is I'm allowing them to identify goals and we're literally making a paper chain like you would find around a Christmas tree and each link of the chain is one step toward achieving that end goal at the end of the chain. So those are the kinds of things I try to bring into the classroom to help them visualize and identify uh, their goals and how they're going to reach them. So one of the activities I do with our uh, seventh and eighth graders is a puzzle activity. And the goal of the puzzle is to illustrate the concept that we should begin with the end in mind. And what I do is I give two groups of students a puzzle. One group has a puzzle with the cover, so they know what the end result is supposed to look like. The other group gets the puzzle without the cover of the box, so they don't know what the end result is supposed to look like. And then they have to compete against each other to see who finishes the puzzle first. The group with the puzzle cover with the box who knows what they're trying to build, they always finish first. Um, The group without the cover, they they don't, they lose. Um, And then we have a discussion about why do we think the students who had the puzzle cover, the box cover, why did they win? Why did they get there first? And students come to realize that it's because that they knew what they were building toward. And without knowing what you're building toward, without knowing what your end goal is, it's really hard to get there. Um, You might get there eventually, but it's easier to get there if you know where you're going. And when you have the cover of that box for that puzzle, you know where you're going when you're building the puzzle. As you listen to the speaker, Reflect on how they provided opportunities for young people to set group and individual goals, pursue various strategies to meet their goals, reflect on progress along the way, and shift gears when necessary. 